case where people go before trial is getting slapped with a lawsuit of its own. A local justice reform group is suing the city of St. Louis over conditions at the workhouse. It's the latest development at the jail that's faced a lot of public scrutiny over the past few months. Our Abby Larico is live there right now with what is to come next. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, Allie and Rennie. Now on a cold Monday morning like this one, that dangerous summer heat wave we faced feels like ages ago, but it's still top of mind for advocates out here because they say the people inside had to deal with miserably high temperatures, and it's something that's likely to be brought up in that lawsuit that's coming out today. Now, the city eventually brought in relief in the form of temporary air conditioning units over the summer, but the critics say they want more permanent solutions. Today, the criminal justice-focused legal group, the Arch City Defenders, is suing over a pattern of what they call a range of inhumane conditions. Some city and state leaders have said the place needs to be shut down. Protesters echoed that idea as they gathered outside, in some cases pushing through the fence to get their message across times over the summer. Now, the heat was one issue, but inmates have also complained of mold and rodent infestations. But one more problem that the city faces when it comes to the workhouse is financial. They're waiting on money that the Missouri government owes them for housing state prisoners, and they're not expected to get that until next year. Now, more details about this lawsuit will come out this afternoon. We'll bring you the very latest from those on KSDK.com as well as the KSDK mobile app. Reporting live from the workhouse, Abby Larico, 5 on your side.